President Trump's administration did not inform Congress ahead of his 11th hour decision on whether to attack Iran. Our Margaret Chadbourne has more on how Texas lawmakers are reacting. When President Trump revealed on Twitter that he had pulled back from attacking Iran with just 10 minutes to spare, Democrats and Republicans were left with concerns. Mainly, will Trump's actions inflame or de-escalate the conflict in the region? It is difficult to tell what the Trump policy is. Uh, it's a bit chaotic. Uh, I just hope that his last action in pulling back is an indication of where he will go, having learned from this crisis. Congressman Lloyd Doggett is a harsh critic of President Trump, yet was pleased the president called off the operation at the last minute. I think he's to be commended for pulling back on this. This is the greatest danger that our country faces right now, and we be, need to be looking for a way to turn down the heat on both sides. Republican Congressman Michael McCall agrees Trump made the right move. I think personally he did the right move by stepping back a little bit, being a little more thoughtful, because once we strike Iranians on Iranian soil, the escalation will, will start. McCall was with other congressional leaders this week at the White House for a briefing inside the Situation Room with the national security team and the president. Probably the most serious thing the president does is you know, deciding to strike a nation. And so uh, we had a, a, a very healthy discussion in the room. But I do think a measured response is necessary. I do think we're going to see additional sanctions on Iran. McCall says Trump wants to work with Congress going forward. But Doggett and Democratic leaders are not convinced. They're putting pressure on the White House for the president to seek congressional approval before he moves ahead with any military action. In Washington, Margaret Chadbourne, Spectrum News.